All right, guys, welcome back to the channel, Hill Creek Outdoors. We got something a little different today. We're going to be installing a couple uh, new tail lights onto the Polaris Ranger XP 1000. It's a 2022 uh, crew cab edition. We were lucky enough to have a Sun Pie Technologies reach out to us and send us a product today, um, and they want to get a little testing here done. So we figured we'd go ahead and help them out. Um, so we thank you guys for that, for sending that to us, and we're going to try to get you all some information on these new tail lights. But uh, we're out here again today. It's nice and sunny, a little windy, but we're going to go ahead and move inside the barn there to get this uh, taken care of. But what we're going to do is we're going to do an installation of the product, which is uh, two tail lights. We're going to kind of compare them to the OEM, also get you some brightness comparison on the difference between the OEM and the sun pie technology product so let's get right into this and i'm going to show you this new product here so we're going to go ahead and do a unboxing here of the product once again it is from sun pie technology so we appreciate them um, it is for the Polaris ranger um, xp 1000 we do have the crew cab edition and it replaces the oem tail lights from the factory um, the, the version that we have here that they sent us is a smoked lens and it is plug and play so that's really good so we're going to do a little unboxing here kind of show you what's inside the box this is what it comes with so when you pull these out you're going to have your two tail lights here we're going to set them like this they're really nicely packaged in here and good foam so you don't have to worry about them getting damaged during transit um, it does come with, with four bolts that will replace the actual oem bolts that come factory from polaris so we have both here with nice plastic cover them so you don't have to worry about them being scratched either and then it does come with um, instructions here to be able to uh, install these but we want to get you a good installation video today um, and it gets you some good comparison on what the OEM looked like compared to the SunPi technology product and also get you some good uh, brightness tests so we'll do that um, when it gets dark we'll, we'll probably put we'll install one have one of the OEM on the other side and we'll show you the difference in comparison um, at night and we'll do some comparison in that way so what you're gonna need for the installation is pretty simple you're going to need obviously a ratchet and a 10 milli 10 millimeter socket um, if you want to have an extension it might make it a little easier so your choice but really all you need is just a 10 milli and a ratchet here so once again they do have really good instructions here that they send with the product um, you have some qr codes here if you need to scan them for any reason um, but yeah, it goes through each picture of what you got to do. Pretty simple, so hang on to that. But once again, we're going to take this 10 milli. We're going to remove these two bolts here from the factory setting to remove the OEM. We'll move this out of the way here. To remove the OEM tail light. I would suggest using hand tools for this. I wouldn't use power tools. There's really no sense in this. Two bolts are not very big, and you don't want to risk damaging the bolts or the tail light assembly. So once we have this removed, it's pretty simple to pop these tail lights out. Give me one second here, and we'll get this bolt out here. But I really do uh, think these look pretty nice. Um, I like the smoked look. Let me know what you guys think. Um, everybody's different, but I think they do look really nice, and they're going to complement at least this color on, on our Ranger. But we want to definitely get a good comparison. So once you get these two bolts out, you can put them right there. Sun Pie Technologies, they do send you four extra bolts so you can replace them. But this just pops out. What you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and unplug this here. And you can set your OEM off to the side. Um, Why we do that, I kind of want to show you the, the comparison in... Oh, isn't that the most satisfying feeling right there, removing plastic. So let's look at the difference here. 
kind of compare them. So obviously you can see red, they're both LEDs, but red OEM, and then you have your smoked from SunPie Technologies. It does have a little different light pattern, but there's kind of the gist of what it, the difference is. Once you have that removed, all you gotta do is just, like I said, it's a plug and play. You just pop that on there, make sure there's no water in there, snap it in, so it clicks. You're gonna throw that housing right back in there, and it's gonna slide right in here. Just like so. Sometimes you gotta, there we go. I guess my hands were a little dirty. I'll have to wipe that off. We're gonna take our new, our new bolts and we'll replace the factory ones with the new ones that they provide. Always start your bolt with your hands. That way you don't worry about stripping. Get them both started. And we're just gonna go ahead and tighten it down here. Pretty simple uh, installation. Shouldn't take you, but maybe probably 10, 15 minutes at max if you uh, aren't talking like I am. But we just want to make sure that y'all are on the same page here. So let's get these tightened down and we're going to show you the difference of how they look um, on the Ranger compared to the OEM on the other side there. So that one's getting close. We'll show you the fit and finish, how well it looks. And I believe we're good right here. So now we got the one on the driver's side installed. Let's take a look here at the fit and finish. The seams line up really well, fits in there really nice. Um, I don't see any issues in regards to any fit or finish there. Everything looks perfect. It is waterproof and all the information is going to be in the description guys on this product so you can take a look at it or even purchase it on Amazon if you'd like to do so. Um, they do sell them on Amazon but we want to get some good testing for them. So there's that compared to the OEM on the passenger side on the right here. It does complement the colors fairly well if that's what you're looking for. And then here is the OEM just to kind of compare how it fits in there. It fits exactly like the OEM does. So we're going to do the exact same thing on the right side for the installation. So I wanted to give you a quick rundown. It is still daylight out, but I want to show you what the comparison is in brightness. You can see the difference in the LED light pattern. This is the Sun Pi technology smoke. And this is just your normal tail lights. So you can tell it is quite a bit brighter than the factory OEM. So let's show you some breaks here. Hey, Ian. There's the difference in the brake lights. One on the left is a little bit brighter. And it also gives you still that halo on the outside of the light. So here is both tail lights installed. Once again, they do have a really good finish. Seals up completely around. They have a nice look with this paint color for the Polaris Ranger XP1000. Um, we're gonna go into the video for the darkness to show the difference in the brightness. So we'll have the passenger side um, will be the OEM and then the driver's side will be the new tail light there from Sun Pie Technology. Here's the difference between the OEM on the right side, which is the passenger side, and then the new tail lights there. You can tell the difference. Go ahead and turn those brake lights on. You can tell the new one is much brighter than the OEM. Tail lights, brake lights, and the brake lights here. 
picking up quite a bit of light here the camera but it's a lot darker um, you obviously need some light here really to walk around we turn the lights out but you can kind of see how these new tail lights look go ahead and turn those brakes on Peyton there's the brake lights look how bright those new things are Wow all right guys so that pretty much wraps up the video but we wanted to say a special thanks to Sunpi technology for sending out this product um, we appreciate y'all um, asking us to test the product out. So if you guys want to check out the description and learn a little bit more about the uh, product, uh, please do so. Um, once again, it was the smoked um, tail lights there. It is a new design compared to the OEM tail lights from the factory. Um, once again, they are all LED, but we got our install done, showed the difference in the comparison and brightness and different how they fit into the Polaris Ranger XP1000. Um, it is compatible for 2018 to the current model, 2022. So check that out. We appreciate you all coming back once again. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time here on Hill Creek Outdoors, we'll see you.